Well, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. I just signed into law the Emmett Till Anti-Lynching Act, making lynching a federal hate crime for the first time in American history. Between 1877 and 1950, more than 4,400 black people were murdered by lynching, most in the South, but some in the North as well. That's a lot of folks, man, and a lot of silence for a long time. Lynching was pure terror to enforce the lie that not everyone, not everyone belongs in America, not everyone is created equal. Terror to systematically undermine hard-fought hard civil rights. Terror, not just in the dark of the night, but in broad daylight. But the law is not just about the past. It's about the present and our future as well. From the bullets in the back of Ahmaud Arbery to countless other acts of violence, countless victims known and unknown, the same racial hatred that drove the mob to hang a noose brought that mob carrying torches out of the fields of Charlottesville just a few years ago. Racial hate isn't an old problem. It's a persistent problem, a persistent problem. Hate never goes away. It only hides. It hides under the rocks. And given just a little bit of oxygen, it comes roaring back out, screaming. But what stops it is all of us, not a few, all of us have to stop it. 